Welcome back to Elden Ring in the Siofra River. Let's explore. Are those enemies? Yeah, they are. Spirit versions of them? Because we've encountered those before, but not... Not with the glowy bits. <laughs> cookbook let you do does it give you more armor alterations is that a thing expands crafting repertoire no exalted flesh fire bone arrow fire grease preserving boluses I love that these creatures are underground. You wouldn't expect to see them in what is essentially a cave. Okay, those balls of electricity. I can't target them as an enemy. Oh! Oh! Wow! Are they just environmental hazards then, if I can't target them? No, no, no. Ugh. I think I need to give them some Roa berries? Roa... Roa raisin. One more. Good boy. Haven't done that in forever. idea where this is going to take me, but I guess let's go. Oh, it's not that far away. Yeah, you don't even need to use that to get over here. You could get here. Oh, something died. You could get over here just on your own. that they did around that walking mausoleum. Oh, 
Ah, I want that ball. Ash of War square off. No, 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 don't, don't. Oh, thank God. It came up short. It was going to hit one of the deer. Just six more to go. I get up there. Didn't expect a seller. Wait, what's over here first? Absolutely nothing. Grass? Huh? Precious item ahead. I don't see anything on the roof there. Merchant ahead. Cave ahead. Oh, they're playing. Is a good sort. Ooh, oh, a customer. Aw, this one's abandoned merchant. 
they sell soap. I'm gonna buy some just cause. Nascent butterfly. Exceedingly rare to find. Yeah, I haven't found a single one. Maybe I should buy all of them. Cookbooks, absolutely. Chotel, curved sword. I think I want that too. Might as well buy all the stone sword keys as well, and I want all the nascent butterflies. Oh. I have so many runes. Oh my god. There we go. Bottom all. Goodbye. Till next time. Curved sword with a severely hooked blade. Its attacks can slip through an enemy's guard. Made to hunt down humans, this weapon requires high dexterity to wield effectively. Hmm, 19 dexterity, yeah. Almost makes it sound like it would do bleed damage, but it doesn't. It's a very light weapon. Exceptionally light. It looks quite short as well. I'm not sure what they mean by can slip through an enemy's guard. Does that mean anything, practically speaking? It's quite fast. Is that faster than the... the flail? One, two, three, four. One, two, three... Yeah, definitely faster. Oh no. Ah! Uh Gotta make sure the merchant doesn't get hit by those. Hidden path. There's always the chance it's one of those super strong ones that requires a bunch of hits. <laughs> nah, forget it. fighting something else. Maybe they just had the zoomies. Let's make sure we don't miss anything, so I need to light every single fire, and there's six more of them, so they're probably pretty densely packed. Ooh. 
Okay, we're fine. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh. Oh. They look strong. Well, we wait for that to pass. Ooh, jawbone axe. Actually, has really modest stat requirements. Just fourteen strength. I just need one more. To wield it one-handed, it does wild strikes. Nice. Axe made from an herbivore skull, weapon of the ancestral followers who disdain metal. This axe is more of a bludgeon. It forgoes a bladed edge, instead using the beast's molar teeth to buffet foes dealing strike damage. Is that different from other axes? Standard... Wait, is strike an actual type? Well, I don't have enough on me to really be able to tell. I think strike is an actual type of damage, but it says it does standard. That's weird. God, it is pretty cool. Look at that. Just whacking people with a bunch of molars. Brutal. Hey, there's a blood stain up there. At the very, very top of the screen above the compass. Which means somebody got up there. How? It's the wolf! I can't target them. It's friendly. Uh, before I do anything like that, though, I want my souls back. There's a spirit spring. That's how they got up there. Ah, good to see you. Damn, they're so tall. Apologies, mate, but I don't have much to report. I can see bloody Nokron right above me, but I'm absolutely stumped. I've tried all the gateways, to no avail. Perhaps it's time to ask Celebus. I recall that spiteful little rat acting like he knew something. Let's give him a squeeze. Show him just how sharp my teeth are. Please do take a bite out of that asshole. 
my jest. I wouldn't go that far. Oh. Besides, I should check on some things here. Leave this place to me. You just do what you feel is right. If either of us learns anything, we tell the other. Right? Leave this place to me. If either of us learns anything, and if we read. I wonder if I should go speak with Salubus. Utility. <laughs> that wasn't close enough to it. Oh, what's the intended way to get off here? Just ah, just go down here. And yes, I did see the little cubby down below. I will go in there. It's where the, um, at the four belfries. One of the pathways took us there, we climbed down the rocks, and then we fought that person that was at the end there. Oh, it's so cool to see it from the other side now. I swear I probably have more than ten stone sword keys. Fourteen. I assume if they exist in the world, then there's a use for them. Like, I, I assume they don't give you more keys than you can use. I hope. Wait, can I actually get back? Uh... I think I can... No. No. Abandon. Abandon. Abandon ship. We're teleporting back. That is that is not going to work. How do I get in there, actually? Maybe I need to fall down over here. Oh, yeah, that does it.
they can use their horns to attack. That's really cool. Five more. Oh, shit. Where do you go? Be wary of magic butthole. <laughs> do it I guess magic butthole here we go wait wasn't I just like I was here that's it, it barely took me anywhere I guess that's the point. The wolf was saying that they tried every portal and they couldn't find a way to get to Nokron. I guess it's meant to be kind of a maze, so a lot of these don't take you anywhere useful, I guess. This looks really close, but we're actually up on this ridge. I don't think there's any other way to get up here. To this upper area. Yeah, we're way above where we were before. This is actually useful. Oh, I hear tinkling in there. Oh, 
no. <laughs> Sorcery ahead. Yeah, let's just go inside. I'm tempted by the meteorite again, just because there's so many of them. No, that's terrible. Honestly, just chaining backstabs might be a better way to go about this. Great oracular bubble. Probably takes arcane, the other bubble magic did. Still no hidden path. They do exist though. Maybe they haven't been to Rhea Lucaria yet. I see a blood stain up there, so there's a way to get up there, too. That looks like a boss. That's definitely a boss. Fall, don't fall. Something incredible ahead. I can't get back up though if I do that. But yeah, that leads over here and then over here and then over there. It does seem important, but not just yet. Because I can't get back up. If only I had a dog. Oh, Crab.
cave ahead. <laughs> All right, let's fight this boss. Stick our flask of wondrous physic. What are you? Dragon. Ooh, that almost killed me. Oh, they look so happy. Look at them. They look so excited. Dragon Halberd. Requires 22 strength. Halberd shaped like a dragon, enwreathed with both ice and lightning. Alas, the Dragonkin soldiers never attained immortality and perished as decrepit, pale imitations of their skyborn kin. Aww. Beautiful. Oh, that's so cool. As you drag it on the ground, listen to it cut through the water. That sounds really good. The other Scar Seal I have for Redon's is extremely good. Or not Redon, sorry, Radigan's. Oh, that does the same thing. Oh. Does it... I mean, the item effect it says is the same. Is it literally the same thing, though? It raises my arcane by three, faith by three. Three, intelligence by three, and mind by three. Vicar Endurance, Strength, and Dexterity. This one does mind, intelligence, faith, and arcane. Okay, well, most likely the damage increase is probably the same as the other one. And I think the other one increased damage by, like... What was it? It, it was something... Almost irrelevantly small that was offset by the increase in your stats. But this one doesn't actually give you more health. But still, oh, just by increasing my mind by three, look at my FP. It goes from 112 to 130. Now, granted, the Faith and Arcane are probably going to be wasted. But three more int and three more mind, I think it's worth it. Yeah, especially compared to raising the potency of sorceries. Oh, I think this is the one that increased the damage you do by like 4%. But I'm sure it would do the same just to increase my intelligence. And then the mind is bonus on top. Uh, I think I want to keep the curved sword talisman. Enhancing guard counters. But yeah, let's put this in. Going for full glass cannon. No item ahead, but praise the research. Well, thank you. I gotta see what's up there, you know? Even if there's no item, I just want to see what the sights are from here. 
Yeah, it's just a nice spot, isn't it? I like to praise the research. Like, good job for you trying to think outside the box. Is there no way from here to get up there? Because I know you can eventually get up there. Yeah, no way up there as far as I can tell. Let's head down. No item ahead. Okay. Remember rune arcs and how I've never used them? Yeah. One day, maybe. Hmm. There might be something up here. ahead. They weren't messing with me. of Archer. Gotcha. Oh, shit. I don't have any more FP. Oh, no. Okay. Melee only. Here we go. I think I can, like, they can shoot me lar uh, at a larger distance than I can even target them. I have their ability with the bow, and even I can't hit them from here. What the hell am I supposed to do about that? Like, are you gonna stop at some point? Tied behind another tree. I guess we're okay. Four more, I think. Ah, oh, 
Yes, I got two FPs back. Yeah, I can get back up. Oh, not another one. Behold, hole. Oh, hey, wait a minute. I've been here before. Yeah. I was over there. There was a beetle over there. Okay. Wait, did I use that... that gateway? Oh, ah! Rip 20,000 souls, 27,000. Oh, hey! On my way back, I just discovered a side of grace. Worshippers Woods. Ah, yes, I got the souls back! Quick, hide! Oh. Those rats came from.
I didn't. Oh, I didn't want to rest there. It's going to respawn all the enemies. Below the well. Oh, is this another entrance? Spend our level on. I think it's time for some more health. Vigor. Clarifying Horn Charm. Raises focus. Governs resistance to sleep and madness. Ooh, take Stone Sword Keys. Christ, we're moving fast. How far up are we going? I mean, just to the surface or higher? I swear this is way higher up than the last one was. Kaled. Deep Siafra Well. Oh. <laughs> we're here. First off, regret. Yeah, same. I want to go home. God, I love how different this place looks. Looks like the map is really close by. Uh, okay, never mind. Really close by is all the way up there. So far up, I can't even move my view up enough to look at it. That is not close by at all. <laughs> no. Well, that was lovely. I'm going back down. Right, back down here. This one over here still needs to be lit. I noticed that when I was running back to get my souls. It's surrounded by the little balls of electricity, but maybe I can sneak? Mm. Jesus. Oh. Oh, after it shoots, it disappears? It's used up. Okay. Ah. Now, I'm pretty sure I still need one more, and I have no idea where it is. There's this whole upper area that I still haven't been to. I think... I think there's a portal I haven't used. Yeah, this one? I'm really not sure if I've used it or not. Oh, no, I have. Yeah, that just... Goes back and forth here. Oh, I think it's up here. Yeah, I haven't been up here. Ah. 
power gathers somewhere in horned remains. Are you a boss? I have to touch it. Hmm? Where are we? Just somewhere out in the void. Oh my god. Ancestor spirit. Look at it out there in the fog. Oh, this is such a cool set. Like, set piece. Oh, so cool. I feel bad killing it so easily on my first try. It's so beautiful. I want to watch it some more. Kick backsies. You think it's parryable? I don't know, it seems too big for that. Okay, I'm sorry. That was a really cool boss. out here. Ah, victory. If I touch it again, do I just... Yeah, I just go back here. Let's get another point of dex. Can I tell them anything now? This place to me. You just do if either of us learns anything we tell And if we reach a dead end, I suppose we go back to the source. Celebus rarely gives a straight answer. The first time. Well, I would say we've reached a dead end! So let's go back to Sulevis. Ask about Nokron. Well, well. You're asking me about that, are you? The task was left to you and the mongrel, was it not? Not only are you incompetent, but shameless to boot. Well, there's no helping it. Now's as good a time as any. I'll let you in on it. There's a glintstone sorcerer by the name of Selen in Limgrave. She owes me for the help I gave her when she was expelled from the Academy. I asked her to look into the matter some time ago. I'll write you a letter of introduction. 
Go ask her. Can I read that? Scroll bearing a royal coat of arms, a letter of introduction written by Preceptor Seluvis, addressed to a glintstone sorceress by the name of Selene. The contents of the scroll cannot be discerned. Damn it. Show letter of introduction. Well, well. Seluvis is not a name I ever wanted to hear again. But fine. If it will help you, my apprentice, I offer my knowledge. The stars alter the fate of the Carian royal family and the fate of your mistress, Rani. But long ago, General Radan challenged the swirling constellations and in a crushing victory arrested their cycles. Now he is the force that repulses the stars. If General Radan were to die, the stars would resume their movement and so too would Rani's destiny. Okay, so I need to kill Radan. I heard some people on Twitter talking about being proud to have defeated Radon, and I think the difficulty of Radon was possibly reduced in a patch. So it sounds like Radon was, or well, probably still is, really, really difficult. I also have no idea where they are. I've gotten some new tiers that I haven't looked at in a while. One of them is the Green Spill Crystal tier, temporarily boosts stamina in mixed physic. And I think another one is Spiked Cracked Tear. Enhances charged attacks for a time in mixed physic. I think I actually want to replace this steadily restores HP for a time with Green Spill. Temporarily boosts stamina. I think that'd be more useful. Honestly, the HP, I mean, it does heal over time constantly for like two minutes, which is really nice but it doesn't actually heal that much. Let's see how much of a difference it makes to my stamina. Okay, that didn't make the bar that much bigger, but maybe it also restores faster. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return... Well, before we move to this horrible reddish part of the map, we have all of this to explore, including the Sending Gate.